just a few weeks away from spring break. Now, airlines are saying they're seeing a demand for travel in the islands. KITV4's Eddie Dell joins us live at the Daniel K. Inouye International Airport. And Eddie, is it true? Are we back to pre-pandemic levels? You know, Leia Maleko, we've been at this airport throughout the pandemic. You know we've done countless reports here. And I will tell you, I'm noticing it. it's pumping here. You know, this is some of the most people I've seen throughout the pandemic. Now, officials tell me that um, they've seen very in a lot of encouraging signs when it comes to demand. However, there's still more room for growth when it comes to pre-pandemic levels. Now, joining me this morning is Chris with Hawaiian Airlines. Chris, thank you for joining me. Um, what are you guys seeing? What is the company seeing when it comes to people wanting to travel for spring break. Uh, good morning, Eddie. It's so good to be here. We are very encouraged by the bookings that we're seeing for March and April um, and into summer uh, as COVID cases subside and vaccination rates increase. People are just feeling more confident about traveling and they're traveling to Hawaii and to the mainland. Now, I know in uh, last spring break in 2021, Maui saw a lot, a lot of visitors. They weren't kind of expecting that. And um, what are you seeing for demand across the islands? Is it, It's kind of widespread, right? Yes, we're seeing demand for all islands. And again, strong interest in Hawaii. Now, one thing that, you know, locals like to keep in mind when it comes to tourism is responsible tourists, you know, who when we get that wave of tourists that they don't, you know, overwhelm. Um, tell me about your Travel Pono video. They're, that's on all the flights and they have to watch this video. <laughs> Correct. Uh, Travel Pono is on all of our trans-Pacific flights and it's a way to welcome um, our visitors to the island with information to enrich their travel experience. And also we provide tips on how to travel safely and um, respectfully. All right, well, hopefully they take that message seriously because I know Davey is going to get them. <laughs> if they don't, reporting live in Honolulu at the Daniel K. Noy International Airport. Eddie Dow, KITV4 Island News.